Hi, Scorpio. It's me. It's Julia here to do your love reading. Thank you so much for all your love and support for me and the channel. Cross watchers, you're welcome here. If you like my style, if you like what I'm about, then go ahead and subscribe. I'd love to have you here. Um, just wanted to say a shout out to um, Jean and Ebony and Joy and Marianne and Christina for booking a live tarot card reading for the month of October. And from now on, the promo code will stay the same. The promo code will be New Earth. If you want to speak to my psychics and tarot card readers, there are toll-free numbers for the USA, UK, Canada, and India. You can call up as much as you want and just say New Earth, okay? Another thing that I have in place from now until forever as well, for the users, new users, uh, for my USA viewers, uh, you can call up and say Abracadabra and get a 15-minute reading at $1 a minute. Okay, that's just a special introductory offer for you. Everything else that you need, Scorpio, is listed down below in the description box. Let's get started. I call upon the divine. I call upon the white light to come into this reading for Scorpio. What do we have for Scorpio? What do we call... Oh, okay, hold on. Okay. So, I feel you're believing in... You're trying to be patient here. You may be um, believing in spirit. Here to give you the answers you're looking for. Um, I feel somebody here um, may feel left out in the cold by somebody. From what I'm seeing, we'll, we'll take a look. Okay. Or somebody is just really maybe even homeless here. Um, maybe it's just really getting the um, rug pulled out from underneath them. So signs I'm seeing here are Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Pisces, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, Sagittarius. Um, of course, we have you two here, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Leo, Sagittarius, and Aries. Everybody's here. Let me see what this temperance with the five of, of pentacles is for you in the center of your V. Yeah, you have a choice to make right now. Alright, in the recent past we have the Two of Wands. Why is the Two of Wands here? We have the High Priestess. We have Virgo Energy, Virgo Taurus, Capricorn. So you may be making a decision, um, or maybe you made a decision here based on your intuition about a Virgo Taurus or Capricorn who's very independent here. And you may have decided to cut this person off in the recent past, okay? And it could have, been, you know, it's a, it was a spiritual connection. Maybe this person was actually offering you some kind of stability. Um, I feel you broke their heart, Scorpio, and they walked away because they felt the connection was just toxic between you and them in the recent past. We have the Six of Swords in the now. Looks like you may be thinking about leaving something in the past, maybe traveling somewhere else, or this could be your person, right? Roles can be reversed. Yeah, you may be thinking about going towards this person here, um, that same high priestess, Virgo, Taurus, or Capricorn, because you don't have a choice. You're still holding on to this person. Maybe because things are so dire, now you're going towards them. But I feel this person is uh, protecting themselves here. Maybe they're closed off and they're kind of, um, you know. I feel here this person is um, maybe in the spotlight. I feel this person is headed for their own victory here. Um, they've been healing, and they are moving forward with their life here. 
could be this Virgo Taurus or Capricorn who also has Leo in their chart. Um, I feel they're going to be doing a lot of overthinking about this connection and if they could really be happy with you or not. But yeah, I feel this person may not want this anymore, Scorpio. Maybe because you just didn't treat them right. The Ten of Pentacles. I feel there was a lack of communication here. Um, you know, now this person feels because you need them, you're coming towards them. We have the Ten of Pentacles and the Ace of Pentacles. Um, and maybe that's what you're hoping for, and that's why you're going towards this person very quickly, trying to heal the situation. Um, maybe you're a single parent with a child needing financial assistance. But this person doesn't want to be with somebody who's just coming. Yeah, you want this new beginning here. Um, this person's not expecting you here. And you may be offering your cup of love to this person from the past. Who could be a Leo, Sagittarius, or Aries? Judgment is here. This person is um, possibly... Uh, passing judgment on you here. This person wants justice. They feel they've been treated unfairly by you. The Knight of Pentacles. Or somebody feels that way. Maybe you feel that way. I don't know. I'm just reading it the way it's coming out right now, right? Flip it if you, as you need to. But I feel you were not there. You you know, the thing was, is somebody was not there. Whenever they were going through, um, it was all about themselves. This could be you or your person. Um, they didn't really care about the person that they're now trying to approach, right? But now that they're in need, now all of a sudden they want this person to take them back. The Page of Pentacles, so somebody's coming in as a friend, you know, very slowly here, sending a message, hoping that, um, you know, somebody will be happy with this message that they're receiving. Tell me about the Knight of Pentacles, trying to manifest this connection back, but somebody doesn't know if they want it or not. They may feel like somebody is manipulating the situation. I feel somebody feels, you know what, you had your chance, right? Scorpio, you may be saying this to this person. You had your chance, you know. And uh, somebody's worried now that they have lost an opportunity, that they're going to offer their cup of love. The person that doesn't want anything to do with it. We see the Eight of Wands here. I'm just going to say it straight, Scorpio. I'm sorry. I, I'm not going to sugarcoat it right now. Okay, for anybody. So somebody's going to try to tell somebody how much they love them, how much they're their happiness, blah, blah, blah. Someone is not happy with what's going on here. Somebody may say, you know, let's just work on things. Let me come over there. Let's just take things slow, see where things go. I feel there's apologies coming in. I feel either you or the other person doesn't know who the other person is anymore. There's an apo Somebody's apologizing so that they can get their wish fulfillment here. Scorpio. If this is happening to you, I'd be careful. The Two of Cups, the Page of Wands, the Four of... Yeah, see, somebody wants a new beginning but somebody's, and wants to heal the situation, but somebody's very protective about their home, their family and what they've worked so hard for. We have the Ace of Swords for your person. Someone's going to speak up their truth. Could be you, could be your person, and just set things straight on how they feel. And that's what's coming up right now. The King of Cups, this may be you. You may tell this person that you want something serious with them. You want to give to the situation. But somebody here is turning their back. They're listening to their intuition. Okay? 
Somebody may be defending their independence, their victory, what they've worked hard for. Yes, I feel, you know, um, they'll accept the apology. But there's a lack of trust now. You know, there really is. There's a lack of trust here right now. Somebody's very guarded when it comes to this relationship. Okay, maybe this person is going to go after their own dreams. Maybe they feel like they um, no longer want to be where they're at and they want to go somewhere else to find their happiness. Maybe their happiness is with somebody else now. The Seven of Cups. Why is the Seven of Cups here? And the hopes and fears. Yeah. Somebody is selecting the option to actually... Um, this could have been you, Scorpio. Somebody had a lot of options, and now all of a sudden you miraculously go, oh yeah, this would be the better option for me. Right? And you may be leaving the past behind and going towards this emperor. By the way, we have the emperor and the empress. Tell me about the Seven of Cups. <clears throat> but see this person already knows you're going to come towards them or somebody already is aware that somebody's going to be returning back okay but they're blocking it they're blocking this new beginning Yeah, and now you don't know what to do, or somebody doesn't know what to do. They're not sleeping good at night because they they don't know if their cup of love is going to be accepted or not anymore. Because, you know, somebody here stopped communicating. Somebody here may have pushed their person away. And now all of a sudden, because they need them, now they want them back in their life. And that person is saying, you know what, where were you? Right now, because you need me, you're coming back, and you want to get, work this out, and you want to come together. That's not a relationship. I mean, if if you know, if you're in a relationship with somebody and you're going through something, you're, there's supposed to be communication, right? So I feel this Empress here is really, I mean, thinking a lot about even if she wants to even. Um, build with this individual okay she's trying to get enlightenment but something is telling her um you know i've been through this before i'm not doing this again tell me about this eight of swords i feel scorpio you have fought a lot of battles in your life and you're not about to repeat the same cycles as before i feel Somebody here is turning their back, right, and waiting for divine timing and for um, real love to come in. And I see it does happen in the future, okay? Judgment is here. The Ten of Cups is here. And it happens when somebody actually removes themselves from a past situation and goes towards their wish. Okay, so Scorpio, that's what I have for you. Um, so expect somebody to return back, but I don't think you're going to take them back, right? That's what I have for you. There's something better for you. Somebody really that you are meant to be with, all right? But it requires for you to make a move. All right, Scorpio, I love you. I'll see you again tomorrow. Love and kisses.